Hello healers, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today the pick a card is all about can you get them back or should you move on? Okay, any relationship that you had and maybe you're still thinking about your ex or maybe you're just trying to decide, okay, will you ever have them back? Well, is it worth it to wait or should you just move on and uh, take care and maybe open the doors for another relationship, okay? So this is all about that. We're going to pick the cards together. We're going to shuffle together here. So I have a full tarot deck piles here and um, I also have extra cards here that I'm going to add at the end, Oracle Oracle cards, okay? But these are uh, full uh, tarot decks. So this group number one, two and three. So you see which one resonates with you the most. Go with your first choice. It's most likely the right one. But of course, you can watch the full video, see which one resonates with you the most, okay? So this is going to be group one, two and three. So if you want to look at the pile, you note know, the images on the back and see which one calls your attention. And just think about that person, okay? The one that you're trying to take it back or just trying to make a decision if you should move on, okay? Just concentrate on this situation and then pick the pile and it's most likely the right one. If it helps you out, like guys, like always, uh, let me know if it resonates, if it helps you out in any way. You know, I'm always happy to hear from you. So leave me a comment, leave me, you know, your information that if it helps you. Any suggestions for new pick a, pick a card videos, I'm always happy to bring them into a video here for you. So leave me your suggestions as well. Anything you want me to add as a video here. You know, I'm always happy to incorporate that into a new video. And thanks very much for being here. You know, if you're a subscriber, if you're not yet, consider subscribing. There are many other videos here for you, okay? There is on no pick cards of the week. There is week ahead readings, deck reviews, and many others. Like I said, you can suggest and I can add here to the channel. Okay, so I'm really happy that you're here. If you're already a subscriber, thanks very much for coming back. And again, if you're not yet, consider subscribing, okay? Guys, all my details will be below. If you wanted to have those cards for yourself, always I, I add the cards that I use. If you want to have a private reading, I do that as well. My details will be below. Or if you want to support this channel, there are many other ways that you can support this channel. I'm really grateful for all the support. And if you want to do that, all the links will be there as well. As well as the timestamp, okay? So the timestamp will be there and on the first pinned comment. So guys, again, concentrate on this situation. Okay, can you get them back or should you move on? Group number one, two, and three. Thanks for watching. Group number one, if you chose this beautiful deck here, should, wow. Okay, this is jumping, we leave here. Can you get them back or should you move on? Okay, I'm gonna get a few cards here. Okay, anything that, like that on jumping, no problem, I'll take it. I feel like taking five cards, okay, for this if i feel like taking more but there'll be the extra oracle cards as well okay you'll see all of them this is the one jumping which is the star four of wands page of swords four of swords ace of cups wow beautiful cards here for you group one straight away here with this star okay the star i feel like is that hope okay is that wishing on the star make a wish if it's something that um, you wanted to hold on okay it's like uh, make a wish so what is your wish right now okay do you want this person back okay it's time to make that wish okay to come back it's like that hope as well okay there is a guide as well the star guides you to a direction so you could be guided now to still hope and make a wish okay of what you want because you can see the star is a direction, is a light, okay, that you can follow. And next to the four of wands, the four of wands is that uh, celebration as well. Is the time to to get together. So it's like um, really, it's it's hinting here, guys, that uh, there will be another chance, okay? There will be another chance to meet again. It could be in a gathering, it could be any situation that you have friends around, because there is the page of swords here. They still need uh, need to learn more, okay, about the situation. They still need to communicate well. Maybe the communication has not been very clear in a way like it could have been a bit childish in a way or has not been well thought. But this is a time that you can learn a bit more about the situation, about the other person, why they were communicating that way, why they acted that way, that you're separated, you end up separated, okay, guys? The Four of Swords is asking for, for like, patience, like, rest a little bit, don't stress out about the situation, because the Ace of Cups is showing, like, the chance, the connection again, okay, like, uh, emotional fulfilled, 
guys with these cards here i do feel like there is hope okay because the star here is a straight one there is hope for this to come back of course it's your choice at the end of the day and you will make the decision okay but there is hope that there will be a way of communicating again and uh, like it could be uh, early stages but if you don't stress out okay if you just leave things flowing naturally I feel like there is a way to come back here. But there's a little bit of patience as well, okay? And there's definitely a need to learn more, to speak clearly, to be honest with each other. There will be a chance, in case you're not communicating at all and you're thinking like you're not even getting any messages, there will be a chance, okay? I feel like there will be a chance, like with this four of ones here, that will be some kind of gathering, some kind of situation like, um, you know, maybe you're going out or you're having a wedding, you have something that you're going to go and you're going to have a chance to meet this person again. Just to, just to let you know, okay, in case there is a miscommunication that you're not uh, having even a chance to meet again, I feel like there will be a, a chance, okay, for some of you guys, maybe not all, all of you, so like always take what resonates because it could be that uh, some of you are not communicating at all, okay, so but there will be a chance again, okay, there, there is a hope, okay, guys, but like I say, there is a need to learn to communicate again, like clearly and be honest with yourself and with the other one but communicate uh, in in uh, in a way that you you being honest with the other one like uh, avoid any childish behaviors or any communication that will will not help at all okay it's just a time to to relax a little bit and recharge and learn what you have learned so far that didn't work didn't help in the situation how can you bring this back, okay, in a, in a positive way? Because the chances here, the Ace of Cups is really showing that connection, the door opening for love, okay? So there will be a chance, like I feel like connected with the Four of Wands, the Hope of the Star, I feel like there will be another chance to communicate again if you're not, to sit down and talk, okay? But this is a chance to really learn a bit more about the other one, why they behaved the way they did, why the situation ended up as it was, okay? But there is hope, guys. Group one, you definitely have hope. I'm gonna ask here for more clarification here with the Oracle cards, anything that could be for you, for the other one, okay? Unity, okay? You understand, you can see here, you understand that the love shared with another is amplified and has a ripple effect across the universe. Very interesting because I do feel like uh, there is a chance for unity again. Like I said, like a chance to communicate again. There will be a chance. And if you understand, the guys, that this is, you can understand each other. Like understand that the love shared with another is amplified. So it's a way for you to share. You will have a chance to share again with the other person. Like I say, if you want, guys, of course, you know, and um, it's your decision at the end of the day. But there is a chance for unity again and to share again, okay, and be amplified. So I feel like with this amplified, it could be that. Um, you will actually learn why uh, it situation ended up the way it did. Maybe there's some growing up here for both sides, okay? That you will be able to learn a little bit more with the Page of Swords represented. You'll learn a bit more about the, the other and, like I said, why you ended up the way you did. And if you can grow a little bit with this situation, understanding each other, communicating better, okay? There's a chance for unity here. And it is a beautiful connection represented with the Ace of Cups, okay? That unity, okay, with the hearts that will actually resonate and help you out and uh, emotionally fulfill something that you're really going to be happy about, it, okay, guys? So there is a chance here. There is a hope. But like I said, of course, it, it depends on you, the way you're going to communicate, the way you're going to recharge and sit down, and not stress out, okay? Not be counting. When is this happening? It's just really asking you a little bit of patience here with yourself and with the other. So be careful with the communication. You have this chance to meet again, okay? Just pay attention to that. And uh, I feel like this can really be beautiful here, guys. It's up to you, of course, but there is hope, okay? Straight away here, the star card, and it was the one that jumped out. So definitely there is that hope okay the hope jumped from the the pile here i really feel like uh, there's definitely hope here and uh, like i said a chance to meet again in case you're not communicating a chance to sit down okay and uh, use this chance use it well to to discuss what uh, you feel okay being honest with yourself and with the other okay and um, not holding back just make sure you communicate well and learn about the other one what uh, what are they trying listen as well okay and uh, try to put yourself in the other one's shoes and see here. But there is definitely a chance here again, guys, because Ace of Cups here represents like a like a starting again, okay? Like a chance to refresh, like starting again, a new phase, 
Okay, so that's what I feel like the Ace of Cups is represented and the unity here of the, the other card confirming that. So I really feel there's a chance here, guys. Okay, it's up to you, of course, but there is hope here. Okay, and there will be a chance really soon for you to sit down and talk. This is what I have here for your group one. Definitely, you can get this person back. Okay, depends on you, of course, and of what you want. But there is a chance here, there is hope. Okay, the star card is here. Let me know if this helps you out in some way, guys. And like always, leave me a comment. You know, I'm always happy to hear from you. And this is what I have here for your group one. I wish you a lovely, blessed and healing day. Thanks for watching. Group number two, if you chose this beautiful pile here. Can you get them back or should you move on? Okay. Take a few cards here. If you are trying to get out. Can you get them back or should we move on? I'll get extra cards as well, okay guys, at the end with this oracle cards as well. But we see all of them here together. The Chariot, Temperance, High Priestess, Knight of Wands, and the Lovers. Wow, interesting cards here together. Okay, guys, the chariot here. I feel like the chariot is showing movement, okay? Something is moving here, like uh, moving forward, okay? So there is some kind of movement. So there's maybe if maybe there's some kind of communication. Maybe it has already started for some of you. And there's some kind of movement here. Or maybe the other person is just thinking about you or trying to communicate with you or just considering that, okay? There's some kind of moving forward. And there's a need to bring balance, okay, with the temperance here. Maybe the situation ended up the way it did, like you separated because that was out of balance, okay? Maybe one was giving more than the other. The relationship was not a back and forward, very balanced, okay? The emotions and the, there was something out of balance. But the temperance is showing here like the balance like can come back, okay? But it can come back, of course, with this movement, maybe the other one trying to contact you, or even you, maybe you have reached out, okay? But there is a need here with the high priestess to pay attention to your intuition, okay? What is your intuition actually telling you? Because is it a chance for you to really, if you have that hope inside you, okay? What, what are you actually telling yourself okay can you listen to that intuition you have to be honest with yourself as well okay what have have you really been feeling here because it's a need to move forward as well and bring balance back into your life but with the knight of wands here also i feel like represented someone here coming forward okay and uh, with that passion there is still passion there is a connection that is still there okay guys for the two of you i feel like there is that passion is still there is something there is a fire that uh, is not dead okay because we also have the lovers here and the lovers really show like it's a choice it's very interesting here the lovers like representing the two of you okay i feel like this is a very interesting pile here because you know in a way it really depends on what you're feeling right now as the high priestess like paying attention to your intuition okay because there's a need to move forward okay i feel like uh, it's this really depends on you okay guys what do you actually want to do here because if you wanted to communicate again if you wanted to reach out if you want things moving or if maybe you accept that that communication that they are trying to to give back to you okay maybe they're trying to contact you and you have rejected at least some of you guys like always take what resonates okay some of you could have rejected this already that this person have been contact okay but in any case what i feel here is like you can bring this back okay the situation back the person back to you i feel like it depends on you what you want because it could go either way here like in a way just pay attention to what you are feeling okay you are this high priestess i feel represented like what is your intuition really telling you because this moving forward could be like the relationship can finally move forward again and uh, okay the communication again if you bring the balance if you can bring the balance okay because the passion is still there the lovers are here i feel like definitely you have a chance back okay guys but this really re depends on what you want because i feel for some of you maybe some of you don't want okay maybe some of you just wanted to move forward and if that's the case guys of course this is nothing set in stone you can always move forward and you have the willpower to change your life okay 
if what you're feeling right now like the high priestess your intuition is that you wanted to let go just to let you know guys for some of you who want to let go you do have a chance to just go moving forward okay you actually gonna move forward and meet someone new just to let you know guys in case you you are worried that you're gonna be alone you don't want to let go of this person for some of you okay i'm just letting you know because i see here there's new love okay ahead as well in case if that's what you want but if you don't want to let go guys there is a chance as well okay so you can you can move either way here for group two it's very interesting because if you wanted to contact again there will be a chance again and if you wanted to bring the balance back but this balance guys remember this is a back and forward okay the relationship it depends on the other person as well just don't don't forget that okay because the lovers here this is like the two working together to grow to learn from whatever didn't work so far any mistakes anything on the past that didn't work how can you bring the balance back into this relationship if the two of you can work together you can definitely bring it back okay to these lovers you need and make the right choices because the passion is still there i feel like definitely there is a chance here guys okay if you want but you're gonna have to work together okay you're gonna have to to really sit down talk communicate decide and realize understand why it didn't work so far why it, it got to this point that it didn't work and um, you ended up separate so why did this happen okay guys you needed to learn with the past okay and move from any patterns that was, was not bringing the two of you anywhere if you can bring the balance back working together this can definitely bring a beautiful union okay guys i just said for some of you i do feel like some of you want to move on and uh, are just worried about being alone just don't worry about that okay because if you focus on your passions the things that you want there will be new love for you guys just to let you know okay but for some of you who you really don't want to let go the chance is there as well but only when the two of you work together okay and you have to bring some balance because there was out of balance one of you could be giving more than the other and then um, you know not communicating well here and uh, maybe working too hard on the relationship when the other one wasn't okay but this is going to get okay you can see here like the the balance okay bringing balance back chariot the, the moving forward i feel like there's like two here two here two here the balance is really needed okay this is what is being called my attention this is what i have here i'm gonna add some extra cards here from the the other deck the oracle deck just any extra message here for you or for the other one definitely you have a, a way guys to bring this back if you want okay the card i got here is ownership okay you acknowledge your misdeeds and accomplishments alike and learn to love them all as lessons it's very interesting here because it's similar to what i was saying to bringing back understanding with their communication what have gone wrong okay being able to sit down and uh, learn with the past what didn't work okay so you, you acknowledge your misdeeds and accomplishments what didn't work and what did work what was the good part of the relationship that was working and you can focus on that together and move forward to this beautiful connection of the lovers okay guys so you definitely have hope here guys okay there is a way but it will need to bring that balance and you do have to work together okay remember this and for some of you who just want to move forward there will be new love ahead okay there's no need to worry but the chance here to bring this back into the balanced relationship is here too but ownership okay in both sides you need to take ownership of what worked and what didn't work and what you have to let go and move forward and focus on the good things that you can cons consider and continue together okay guys this is what i have here for you group two it's very interesting because it can go either way but you do have the chance okay but remember you have to work together for that so if it's just one-sided here it's not gonna work but you do if you, the communication is there and you can come back again bringing the balance of the temperance definitely the union of the lovers is still there the chance is still there okay guys this is what i have here for your group two let me know if it helps you out in some way okay like always leave me a comment you know i'm always happy to hear from you and i wish you a lovely day Thanks for watching. Group 3, if you chose this beautiful deck here, what is going to happen in this situation? Can you get them back or should you move on? Okay. Just one, two. Taking a few cards here for you guys. Group 3, can you get them back or should you move on? Okay, I'm gonna get extra oracle cards at the end as well. Okay, guys, you see all of them. We have the hermit, the wheel, 
Three of Pentacles, Temperance, Justice. Interesting. Okay. Guys, with the Hermit here, okay, straight away, the Hermit is that need to reflect and learn, okay? Be a little bit, uh, at least for some time, to be a bit alone, okay? To just reflect and learn, see how you can grow, what you have done so far that have worked for you and something that didn't work, okay? How can you learn with your past, okay? How can you follow that light that will help you grow, to help you move forward, okay? The Hermit is here, that way, showing. And the will, the will is showing like things are moving your way finally like turn, things are turning around okay like there is a there is a, a movement uh a change here of situation okay something that didn't work is like turning around and something that did work okay just leaving things behind and and moving like the will is finally moving here okay the three of pentacles really showing like some hard work okay that have gone through maybe the situation, maybe trying to communicate, or you know where you are so far. Like always, guys, take what resonates. But it's showing like the, the truth of pentacles, really some hard work there. There's some people that uh, are around and can see that hard work, okay? There's some recognition of that. I feel like the other one can see that you have put some hard work here. They recognize the hard work, but is it enough? You know, that's, that's the case. So the temperance is a need to bring balance, okay? Because interesting tempers came on the other deck as well it's a need to bring that balance and with the justice here like the balance you can see here on the picture guys there is a need to bring that back because it could be that uh, one of you were putting more work than the other and i feel like one of you was definitely working hard in this situation and the other one can recognize that and i feel like they can recognize and they look back and they can see that they didn't put so much work on it like you did okay i feel like they can see they recognize that but was it enough? You know, they can see like there was out of balance. Okay. There was no so much. Um, the other person was not doing as much as you did. Okay. And one of you guys, you, one of you was, it was working way harder than the other in the situation, like trying to communicate, trying to contact, trying to make it work. Okay. Trying to understand the other one and the other one was not putting as much work. Okay. And the justice is here showing that, um, Really, is the need for a balance here for, for this to move, okay, guys? And um, it's interesting here. I do feel like there's some growing up to, to be done here, okay? There's a need to, like, uh, move forward. But because the Hermit is the first one that came, guys, I do feel like uh, there is a need to be alone a little bit, at least for now, okay? Because there is some growing up to do. I feel like the other person is starting to see that because I do feel they recognize the hard work you have done. But uh, they... They need to work on themselves, okay? And uh, there is a need for you to allow that as well, for you to leave like the hermit here, to stay a little bit alone, to learn yourself about yourself. What can you do for yourself, okay? How can you take care of yourself in the meantime? It doesn't mean that to never be possible again, okay, guys, in the future. But right now, it's just, I feel like it's a time to concentrate on you, okay? See the things that you have gone so far that didn't work, let go a few things, Take care of yourself, of your mind, of your body, of yourself, really. Time for you, for growing, for learning what you actually want, okay? And leave some patterns behind. There's some things that are needed to leave behind and move forward here. There is a light, okay, guys, for you to follow. And, there is, and the hard work was there. If you really wanted this person back, guys, you really needed to make sure they are, you allow them to grow a little bit first so they can come back to you with the... the the, the balance okay because they needed to learn and bring this balance they need to learn how to give and take they needed to learn how to be in a relationship i feel like they didn't know exactly how to be in a relationship they love the the single life as well okay they wanted the relationship they wanted both sides but it's not always possible you needed to let go of something when you are with someone you cannot just have exactly a, the same life that you had as a single person okay it is interesting here guys the way here i feel like it's time to concentrate on you for now okay and you can move on like i said nothing is written in the stone guys things move and change okay and people change i feel like if you allow this person to grow i feel like there's some growing to do and they will be able to in the future they can come back to you it may be too late maybe you don't you wouldn't care anymore but i feel like they will come back because i feel i feel like there's some kind of um, of, of 
make a, like a resentment from their side and uh, and they do kind of repent in a way you know of things that they have done maybe they have not treated you very well guys you know where you are of course you know just uh, take what resonates guys but i feel like it's time for you to concentrate on you for now and they can turn around okay they can turn around after some hard work but they do have to work on themselves first bring that balance bring that mind into um mind of someone who wants to be in a relationship and uh, i feel like right now concentrate on you so you can uh, at some point to meet again if that's the case but not straight away there's some time to to take care of, like i say for yourself for healing and i'm gonna take some extra card here from the oracle okay the oracle cards i just wanted to see here what comes for you and we do have here past okay so through the power of love you release any stagnant situations or energy in order to transform your heart space this is very beautiful guys it's just as, as you can see i feel like there's a need to release something from the past so there's nothing holding your heart okay because there's chance for new love so don't hold your door okay of love here of your heart because you could be missing uh you could be missing a chance here to meet someone else that can treat you well that can have that balanced relationship can will be able to love you the way you deserve because it's saying through the power of love okay love i feel like especially love for yourself first of all okay will be able to release any stagnant situation if this is holding your life is holding your mind this you will be able to release this okay in this energy so you can transform your heart to space so you give a space to someone else to to yourself first of all to love yourself and be able to move forward okay guys so i do feel here group three that it's a moving forward for you okay there's a chance it's a time for you to take care of yourself be still at least for a while i feel like they will be looking back and uh, be sorry for letting you go okay guys i feel like they may be already feeling that way for some of you at least but they know that you have done so much and they don't, didn't um work as hard as you did or tried as much as you did but in any case they do need to grow up okay i feel like there's a need for things to move forward still they can learn how to be in a relationship they need to grow okay and right now it's just to release the past for you guys and concentrate on you concentrate maybe being alone for a bit and learn to to be alone as well and learn to be happy with yourself okay so you can release okay the energy the past the situation and then you can transform your heart okay and give space space for yourself space to love others someone else someone else that can actually treat you well okay guys this is what i have here for your group three like always let me know if it helps you out if it resonates in any way you know i'm always happy to hear from you and as always i wish you a lovely day thanks for watching